Welcome back to Wolfenstein, The New Order. We just woke up in this asylum for the first time in years and years since the uh, accident where we escaped and got hit with shrapnel in the back of the head. Uh, Nazis have killed everybody except Anya. We need to find them and, I guess, protect them. It's time to kill some Nazis. Stealth is probably a good idea here, because I think, uh, yeah, just the knife and the handgun. A throwing knife? Wait. I can't throw knives yet, though, can I? Yeah, I need to do five silent takedowns to be able to throw knives. Well, let's do some silent takedowns. right there, facing this way. Come on, turn around. Oh, commander over there. Um, also, this gun doesn't have a silencer on it, and I can't put one on it, so I really shouldn't fire it or I'll get everybody's attention. Please on me. Oh, this thing is burst fire? Yeah, it burst fires. Oh shit, there must be another commander. There's the commander. Oh shit! Oh, oh! I think that's the first time I've died. Okay, so we're starting this whole thing over again. Um, I do have one question though. Do the things that I um, do to get my perks, does that persist across saves or is it resetting my progress? Um, let's see... It doesn't reset when you load an old save. Yeah, that persists. Because before I had zero silent takedowns for this knife throwing thing, now I've got three out of five. Okay, cool. Sweet, now I can throw knives! Um, I think I need two knives, right? At least two. Um, when carrying more than one knife, you have the ability to throw knives. Yep. Can't be standing too close to a wall. Or an enemy. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure it's like a guaranteed kill for normal enemies. Non-armored enemies. How many knives do I have right now? Uh, just one, so I can't throw any. Oh, wait, what? Oh! The, um, the amount of knives you have displayed in the bottom right of the screen, that now says zero, above my ammo, that's the amount of throwing knives I have, not the amount of total knives that I have. So if that's one, that means you can throw one and you always have this one. Should be one more commander, right? Where's that commander? There they are. Shooting folks who can't defend themselves. 
Okay, we're good. Could really use some armor. Oh yeah, they didn't just shoot everybody in the room that I was in, they shot everybody out here too. Anything good on the map? Not really. Oh, let's do a cool slide under here if I can. <laughs> I've been here before. Oh, what is that? Armor upgrade. Finding an armor upgrade will add an additional 10% armor points from all armor pickups. Armor upgrade is permanent and will not be reset between chapters. Oh, sweet. Right, that's one of the bonuses you get from the person that I saved and the ability to lockpick. It mentioned something about the armor upgrades. I think... I don't know if this is what you get in the other... in the other, um... character. Like, if you leave Fergus alive and... and, uh... pick the other person to be dissected by General Death's Head. But I know in the playthrough that I watched, there's this thing where you can kind of sleep occasionally, and when you sleep, you find this collectible that gives you a, a bigger health pool. So I don't know if that's the other character's version of this, or if that's separate. I'm not sure. But yeah, there are definitely other permanent upgrades. Whoa. That's new. I don't think I saw that in the playthrough that I watched. So I guess if you go to certain places, you can trigger memories. Interesting. Ooh, new weapon. Double barreled shotgun. 12 gauge side by side break action shotgun. Highly efficient when taking on enemies at close range. Well, let's try it out, shall we? Not exactly the most stealthy of weapons, of course. Uh, it doesn't have any alternate fire modes either. Hello. I think they heard me. Not bad. You really gotta take a couple shots and then hide, though. Otherwise, I'll just be standing in the open with no ammo. You can read this if you'd like to. Oh, that... Wait a second, it just leads, leads back here. Could I have just gone here the whole time? Shortcuts. So these levels are... Oh, they're fairly linear, but I guess they do have a little bit of non-linearity to them. Oh, there's that bunny picture. 
<laughs> this one's stretched though. Oh, somebody painted it in the wrong aspect ratio. Retreat! I think their brain just exploded. I just got a bunch of headshots. So much ammo. You know, I think you move faster when you have one weapon instead of two. Let me just test it. Non running speed, just normal. Yeah, definitely a bit slower like this. You can still sprint with him, though. Much slower sprint, though. I think there's actually a perk that increases your sprint speed when you're dual wielding. I wonder if that would get you back up to the normal sprint speed. Uh, I've already been here. Where, where am I going? Oh, right, I unlocked the door. The door. The door? Which, what's the door? This door. Reinforcements? Drone? I forgot about those things. The WESP drone is an unmanned combat aircraft controlled by a basic AI unit. It was developed in the late 40s by Dr. Ludwig Wald, one of German, uh, Germania's top radio engineers, as a way to efficiently survey large areas of Nazi controlled cities from above without requiring a human component. Since then, it has been enhanced with numerous abilities, such as power-efficient laser cannons and ramjet engines. Meant for surveying, now it shoots lasers. So yeah, it's a, it's a world where the Nazis won World War II, and also they have, even in World War II, they had extremely advanced technology for the time. Like, I mean, this is a, a drone, a flying drone with lasers and jets and artificial intelligence developed in the 1940s. I want to get some headshots here. Don't you throw that grenade. Shit. weapon Tesla grenade. Hand grenade with a high explosive EMP charge for taking on multiple enemies and creating diversions. Practically charged casing will stick to nearby mechanical enemies and temporarily disable them. Remember to stay out of the grenade's blast range. So can I switch grenade types or is this just like a better grenade? I think Anya's over there. Collect some stuff first, though. Should find Anya and get the hell away from this place. Ooh. Anya, 
get you out of here. USA. I'm sorry. My Polish isn't very good. Are you fit to drive? Where to? Wherever. It's 1960. 1960? Yes. yes. You've stayed with us for 14 years. It's 1960. I, I have to find a way to contact the U.S. military. I gotta find my unit, let them know I'm alive and ready for duty. There's no more war. It's over. No more military. The war ain't over. Look at all these Nazis walking around. They won. It's over. The Nazis rule the world now. They are everywhere. Everywhere. What about the U.S.? The USA. They, um... What's the word? Podacie. Surrender. They surrendered? Because of... You. Oh! Atom bomb. They surrendered 12 years ago when Nazi atom bombed their country. Yes. Well, then I'll find the resistance. I'll find them and I'll help them fight. Oh, no, no, no. More resistance. Everyone is captured. If they leave, the Nazis have them. And who can say where they keep them? I am a trained and experienced field coordinator working on behalf of Generalstraße himself. Do you know how much misfortune you are in if you do not release me? You can read that if you'd like. There is no point in keeping me here. 
Oh, raccoons. Hello, raccoons. They're cute. If you let me go immediately. You have my word on this. Yeah, you're gonna get chainsawed. Need splatter protection. Damn it. Where is the splatter protection? Understand, huh. you damn lunatic, that I am superior to people like you. Warum hörst du? I have been known to be just and fair in dealing with people like you. Do you realize who I am? It would serve you well. You wish I got for down the Herrenanstalts in Sasse! Let me tell you how this is going to work. I'm going to ask you one question. You are going to answer that question in a way I find satisfactory, and if you do not, I will saw your head off with this here appliance, you hear me? So here it comes. Where are you people keeping the captured resistance fighters? I'm sure. I don't know what you're talking about. There is no resistance. What's the hell with you and your damn You want to know? The resistance fighters, where are they? Berlin Eisenwald prison. But you'll never make it there. There are checkpoints everywhere. Looking for you, looking for you. Looking for you and the nurse. And soon they will find this place. And then you will be on your knees! No, not over, not over. Huh? Jesteś przystojny chłop, panie Błaskowicz. Nie taki przystojny jak ja, ale nieźle, nieźle. Pilnuj jej. Rozumiemy się? Albo ja cię znajdę i zrobię ci krzywdę. Rozumiem. Dobrze. Dobrze. Więc wybieramy się do Berlina. We ask for your mercy, Lord, as we make to journey across dark waters. Grant us sound feet and silent breath. Refuge from the storm. And safe passage. <laughs> Take my hand. The road is not safe. You kill the Nazis. Here, I stay with Carl. If somebody. We wait for you here. Huh? Kill everyone. I can do that. You Nazis messing with my friends. We all precious cargo. We have a train to catch. Hold your horses. I'm looking for secrets. I need to go on up ahead, but there's... Is there something down here? Ah. Secret way. Oh, I never noticed that the game has, uh, rain effects. Like... Looks like water's kind of... pouring down on the surfaces.
Uh, what weapons do I have? Just the assault rifle and the knife, okay. It's strange. Did I, like, lose the ability to change modes for weapons? Before, I couldn't put a silencer on that pistol, although I assume just because I didn't have one, but now this assault rifle, I can't switch to, like, the, the single fire mode. Is this a new assault rifle as well? Compared to what I was using in the beginning of the game, since it's so many years later? No, it would have had a new weapon pop-up if it was. Hmm. Yeah, that just leads out to the main area, so what's over this way? Ah, so I just got the silencer for the new pistol. Am I going to find... I mean, what kind of a, an item would I find that would allow me to do a single shot on the assault rifle? That's not really an accessory. for the commanders if I can. Speaking of, whoops, wrong button. Um, what perks should I look at getting? I know I still need more headshots. More mounted kills. Oh, I need more um, kills while sprint sliding. Okay. Just more grenade kills. Stealth kills from thrown knives for this one. Okay, so I gotta start throwing some knives. I don't think I have any right now though, do I? Nope. Ooh. <laughs> Mounted gun. Gonna create an awful lot of noise, though. Nah, I can't get up there. It's a ladder, but yeah, can't get through here. Well, let's get a couple sliding kills if I can, and then I'll use the mounted gun. Uh oh. Probably more likely to get a kill if I do doubles. Didn't get any commanders, but whatever. Okay, I got Endurance 1. So that gives me faster dual-wielding sprint speed. Nice. Perform three kills in a row using dual-wield assault rifles without releasing the fire buttons. Hmm. That's going to be tricky. I'm going to need a lot of enemies in one place. Okay, let's get some mounted kills. Turrets first. Or, not turrets, I mean drones. Okay, uh, let's just take this. I don't think I can... Hit them, I think I'm gonna die, actually. Uh oh, oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, I didn't want to get on the mounted weapon because as soon as I did that, I believe my back exposed. But if I just start picking them off, trying to, you know, take them out so that they're not behind me, then they just keep trickling in behind me. So I think I just need to get on the damn thing and just use it. Oh, all the way back here. Let's try this again. I accidentally shot my weapon, so they're already broadcasting an alarm.
Let's just go straight for the turret. I think I'm... Oh. I'm apparently supposed to go here? Oh, shit. No, I'm not getting on that damn turret. Oh, oh. Health, 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 health. Oh, nice. Oh, got some nice to throw, too. Tons of health. Hmm, indestructible. That future Nazi technology. Trying to get a headshot so I can get that perk. Oh, that's that. Back to the car. Hmm. Probably no stuff around there. Then again, secrets? Nope, just dirt. Oh, they just killed that person. Barely even heard it. Going for headshots. Let's throw some knives, too. Oh, <laughs> hit their feet. Yeah, I killed them by hitting them in the knee, sort of. Actually, it's just kind of in the air. <laughs> that killed them. <laughs> oh, you can read that if you want. So yeah, you can get your knives back. As long as you can find them. Oh, wait a second. I missed something back here, didn't I? Yeah, I can lockpick this place. That just leads back outside. Two doors to this place. That article talked about armed lunatics escaping the asylum. Obviously that's us. Oh, you can climb this thing. What's up here? Looks like a rope that you can grab onto. Ooh. New weapon, marksman rifle. 
Nice. I guess you get that early if you go up here. Scope semi-automatic rifle suited for taking out enemies from long distance ranges. Is this single fire or... Yep. You can shoot it pretty damn fast. Oh, does it have any... Uh... Hold on. Just fumbling with the controls. Does it have any modes? Nope. At least not at the moment. More bonuses. And what's this? Oh no. No! I oh okay. Well. It's fine, it was just some ammo. Okay, let's pick this one now. Here, people. Let's try some knife throwing. Shit. <laughs> oh, hello. Armor upgrade. be pretty close to getting enough headshots for that perk, right? Yeah, I'm pretty close. I just need five more. And then I'll increase the speed with which weapons are equipped and unequipped. Don't know if that'll be particularly useful, but whatever. Feels good to get perks anyway. That's a nice thing about the perk system. I, I think there's two nice things about the perk system. One is that it's sort of like achievements, like Steam achievements, except they actually mean something. I mean, I know some people care about achievements just for the sake of them, but uh, I really never have. These at least have some point to them. You know, some of them aren't terribly useful for my playstyle, but at least they do all have some effect, and some of them are super useful. And the other thing is that because there's always something kind of unique to try to do, like, oh, I need more headshot kills, or I need to do more sprint slide kills, or I need to throw more knives with silent takedowns, and stuff like that. Um, because there's all these things you can focus on that might be outside of the way you typically play. Like, you could just play the entire game just guns blazing, but then you'll be missing out on all the, like, silent takedown bonuses and stuff like that, so these perks give you kind of a an, an impetus to try to change up your play style and try new things, which is pretty cool. Whoops. Glad I could get that back. Bet headshots would be a lot easier with a marksman rifle, huh? Where the hell did I come from? I came from up there. Uh, is there just the one way to go? Yep, looks like it. Didn't mean to switch to that. <laughs> oh, that feels good. The Marsman rifle isn't silenced, is it? Uh, doesn't look like it.
a commander nearby, I should pay attention to that signal detected thing in the top right. Shows me how many commanders are around. Well, they found me. Try the marksman rifle. Ooh, got quick draw. Nice. That makes me able to switch weapons faster, right? Yes. What else to do? Overcharge my health to 200. Kills from cover using handgun. I don't really care about that one. Although, hmm, see? If I get this one, then I can increase the shotgun's magazine size. How does that work? The shotgun's a double barrel, right? Do I add a third barrel to it? Hmm. Anyway, well, now that I've got all the headshots I need, pretty much, um, I guess I'll use the handgun from cover. Shit. Well, what the hell's that commander? They're still not dead. see the signal anymore. Do they just completely disappear? Hoover up the loot. I just pick up? Was that just like a huge hunk of metal? I mean, I know I've picked up metal before as armor, but that was huge. It looks like it's just some stealthy way that I could have taken. I don't know where this is taking me. Looted enough. Uh, up above. <laughs> it's painfully slow. Could you, uh, stop, maybe? Road is not safe! Nazis down there! Shoot the Nazis! We wait here! 
I love that they move like 10 feet forwards and then they're like, all right, go do something again. Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. I. We wait! You should! That's his Then we go! I'm assuming we hit a save point. I hope so. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.